Hi guys, let's look at how you can use custom or unbound uh, text box to calculate totals in Microsoft Access Forms and Reports. Uh, for instance, you may get yourself in a situation uh, like this one where we have items like now I have shirts, skirts, trousers, brows and also uh, sweaters. Therefore, down there, I will be getting the total for skirts, uh, shirts, trousers, blouses, and sweaters. But I would also wish to get total of all these items. Then for that case, I need to uh, use custom text boxes to accomplish that. And for that case, since I have already created the table, let's go to forms. And therefore, you just go to create up here then you just go to uh, that is form wizard then shift everything to your right hand side go to next then this time round choose tabula and then click next then finish therefore microsoft access will create for us the form therefore guys this is the form and therefore i need to have the totals of uh, skirts here totals of uh, shirts, trousers, blouses, and uh, uh, sweaters. Then I also need to have the total of all these commodities to, uh, in a text box. Therefore, I just right click, go to design view. Once I go to design view, I remember calculations are done on the form footer. Therefore, I just pull a bit of my form footer. Then I just go to this point and get the text box. Then I just draw the text box here. Just uh, there. Then just remove this one or just have it as uh, total and just uh, bring it here. Then therefore this one let's have this one as total. Total. Overall total. That is overall. Overall total. Or the grad total in good English. Therefore just go to format. Then can just have it red and bold. Then this one can be pure black. Therefore, just put the black for uh, clarity. Then, guys, you need to mark the name of this text box. That one will be very important. And for that case, instead of drawing another one, just copy this. Copy. Just press Control C, then Control V on your keyboard. Therefore, just remove this. I need this one to be there. Therefore, this time round, I can. Hold shift and copy those two, then paste them. Therefore, you also remove this rebel. Therefore, just drag your mouse across, then bring them there. Then you can just paste one, copy paste. Therefore, I just bring this one here. That is to bring the total of the sweaters. Then the next important tip here is to make sure you know the names of these text boxes. Therefore, just go to design then go to properties here then if once the property sheet is here when i click on this text box you see it is text 15 this is text 17 uh, this is text 19 this is text 20 and this is text 13 therefore you have 13 15 17 19 and 20. therefore first of all we start by uh, calculating the sum of the shots that's the grad total of the shirts therefore just type equals sum then you open the bracket and uh, then type shirts just the way it is shirts then close the bracket then go to i uh, can just copy this function copy control c control v change the word shirts to skirts i go to the next one paste change this one to trousers mark the spellings trousers then go to this one paste then change this one to browse guys remember to mark the spelling otherwise you get hash error or just error then this one is uh, sweaters there we go then from there, I can just run my form and see. Therefore, down here, 
you'll notice that I have the total of these items here. Therefore, as if I add more items down here, you notice that the total will keep on changing. For example, that is 286. I have added 10, it will be 296. That one will be 220. That one I have added 7, it will be 2. Uh, that is 300. This one I have added 5, it will be 50. Therefore, I just need to refresh. There we are. You see now, as I add more items, the totals here change. But now, I need to have the total of to of all this here. Therefore, that one, uh, uh, just to be on uh, on the topic, that is on the uh, point that we are looking at, you'll notice that these text boxes are not the same like this. This one is called shirts here. This one is called uh, skirts. But this one is called text 13. These ones are called unbound controls. Therefore, these ones are unbound. They are not connected to any uh, they are not connected to any table or query. And for that case, if now I need to have the grad total here, that is the total of all these items, therefore I just go to this point, get the text box, then draw the text box here. If I can just have it here, uh, remove its label. Then after doing that, I just go to this point here, then just type, uh, uh, just type, uh, equals that is equals to text 15 we started with the text 13 plus text 15 plus text uh, that is 17 plus text 19 plus text 20 that's how you go about it you see now here 1 2 3 4 5 we have now added the contents of the uh, text boxes in that now if i run my stuff here if i just go to home view you know, notice that um, i have the total of all these items uh, by help of uh, unbound text boxes therefore if i need to do the same in a report it will be actually exactly as I have done in the form. Therefore, there is no uh, big deal. There is no difference between doing it in a report or doing it in a form. Therefore, the formula I have used is the formula you will use in the report. And therefore, guys, that's how you use unbound uh, text boxes to calculate uh, totals among other unbound text boxes. Remember to subscribe if you haven't done that for me. Also share these videos with your friends. Thank you very much.